welcome back to another video. Today I decided to take a break from Planet Side 2 and check out No Man's Sky as there has been quite a few updates. So today the main purpose of the video is just going to be checking out the new update, something really cool they added and seeing if there's any changes that they've made to the base building and whatnot. So I hope you enjoy and as soon as this loads we'll jump right into it. Now if you have any recommendations of other games I should check out, please let me know down in the comments as well as check out my Instagram because I will do frequent questioning or polls of games I should play. On that note, here we go. Wow, interesting. Spawned at night. Well, for base bonus seems like a good planet. Let's go see if we can find some water or something. Right here. Probably a bigger source though, so let's push it up to the atmosphere a bit. See if we can find something. Maybe a bit too high. Maybe not, right here. Structure down and then check out some base building. There we go. That said, it'd be pretty cool to build a base right over there on the island. Wow, actually, that island over there is really flat. Maybe should have flown my spaceship over here, but it seems to be working. Wow, this is pretty good. I'm gonna go put myself right over here. Wow, it's crazy, that's all water. Now if we open up the build menu, we have all these structures. So I say for now, Just build ourselves a little shack, and in order to do that, to have it lifted off the ground, you can simply actually let me go on the build camera. I'm just gonna have myself a little waterfront one. Just place it up like that. Delete. Go to specialist foundations. No. I'm trying to go foundations game. I can do that. 
Or I can go with the circle one, which looks a lot better. Place that, and we'll put down structural supports. And what I can do is go to door. But you're gonna say, wait, but that's already open. Well, there's a little few things you can do with technology, power and industry, power. Well, I'm going to do that, but I'm going to do something a bit different. I'm going to place that there. It's been a while since I've done this, so I'm going to have to refresh my memory a bit on some of this. If I am correct. Is it this one that goes right here? There. Maybe not. Maybe it's delete this, delete this. Let's try it like this. Oh, I do need power to figure this out, don't I? Really quick. Let's go into our multi-tool. Install the survey device. Bam, have that installed now. Oh, we do have one. So for those of you that know, know, the electromagnetic power hotspot provides you with pretty much unlimited power. Nice, and it's on land too. on the build camera and get almost double the energy by stacking two on top of each other which for now only do two I can make some edits if you guys would like me to off the video but then now What I can do since that's too long. Actually. Wait a minute, which direction? Ah, this way. I can just make underground wiring. Or underwater in this case. Apologize for that. Yeah, let's just keep going. Don't do. Just route it over here. Bam. And we'll route it up to here. And then we go on the build camera. 
And if I approach the door, that is wrong. So yes, I believe I had it correct the first time. Maybe not. Let's try something else. Let's try hooking this up to here. This up to here. And this up to here. Maybe not as well. Okay. Let's try this to here, and this to here. Not back away. No. Interesting. One other thing I can think of. Put this up to here. No. Want wiring. Hook this up to here yeah. oh great there we go now electrical wiring to here maybe not okay Hmm. I feel like I had it right the first time. That's when you can see my guy moving around his tool. We Did that, didn't I? Interesting. Well, for now, I think just to save sake, I'll do this off the video. And we will just add a hollow door. Then I'll put an access ramp down. There we go. So now... Oh! I'm trying to destroy my base. Here's a little basic bungalow type of deal. Which I'll decorate off video. But the main thing I want to check out today was the exocraft as they have made a really cool addition to that so that should be in tech specialist exocraft so as per usual we have the roamer we have the nomad we have the pilgrim as usual as well, we always have the Exocraft Summoning Station. I'm going to go ahead and place that on top. The Nautilus for Underwater. It'll let me place it. There we go. Of course, the giant colossus now the thing i'm really looking forward to checking out the minotaur so the minotaur is this really cool mech suit that they added so let's go ahead and check it out a bit more see what it's got to offer Wow. 
switch to the base there a bit. Definitely get the mech deal from this. Let's see how it is running. Oh! Oh, it has launch thrusters. Wow, that's really cool. So, I say we check out how does this look in first person. This is cool. It's got the temperature, it's got a gyro, it's got all the system components. Oh, wow. So this is the size of the inventory tool, that's really cool. So let's see what upgrades this has. It has an Icarus fuel system. So it makes better fuel. That's cool. Have the radar array so we can scan stuff. The mining laser and a cannon. Well, we're gonna have to check some of this out. Oh! They actually added a purpose for the Gravitino balls now. Originally, there wasn't really that big of a purpose, at least to my understanding. Oh, so I apologize for the lag a bit. And it's been funky. Just pretty sure because everyone's isolated. Let's see. Not the best turning radius, but what do you expect for a giant mech? Wow. Oh, you can create terrain. Oh, it's a terrain manipulator. That's really cool. So we got the laser. Wow. That's intense. What would made is a bit hard to control. the rate it mines. It's incredible. Cannon. Wow, hold up. Let's see. Where does this fire from? Oh, fire's from up top. Okay. Yeah, the lasers, cool. Oh, well, I didn't know you could hurt them. Thing's still amazing. Wow, just slid right there. What would be a cool feature to see is when you slide or whatnot, there's like a trail that's left behind in the ground that you could turn on or off in the setting depending on if you want it or not. So that would just be a cool little feature. And I just realized it uh, just has a sheer drop off right there. This is cool, so let's check out what the customization looks like. Uh, 
That's cool, it just kind of closed up. Let's zone him back. Check out its sick dropping. Let's check out some modification. So we can do a primary color. Let's do a little blue accent. That's cool. So, very limited for right now, but still really cool looking wow this is amazing <laughs> kinda looks like a smiley face I don't know if that was intentional but that's pretty funny but yeah overall this is really cool oh that's cool it even paints the hands all these are outlined. It would be cool eventually. I know they have it on those, so it's probably on these, so it's probably a work in progress, but have like the energy change, the thrusters. But yeah, it would also be cool to kind of see eventually, because there's not really much purpose for the hands. Like the blasters in the hands or whatnot, or you can actually like pick up stuff or whatnot. That would be really cool to see. So yeah, this is pretty interesting. That note, no, I think I'm going to wrap it up. So I want to thank everyone for watching. Please go hit that like and subscribe button as it supports my channel. Additionally, please go follow my Instagram for the latest updates on all my equipment and video information as well as polls and recommendations for what games I should play. So yeah, like I said, thank you for watching and see you next time. This is next Wednesday. I'll be posting another No Man's Sky video, unless you guys want otherwise. I'll be posting a poll on my Instagram channel. Additionally, if you have not responded on my other video for Star Trek Online, I'm asking what ship name you guys would want to see and also what ship I should choose for I am at a point where I can get a new ship. So yeah, go make sure to check out that video, and see you next time.